Hey everyone, James with Inspiration here, and uh, this month's assignment is going to be a little bit of a challenge for me, and so I just texted someone from church, and I'm currently waiting on uh, to hear back from them to see if I'll be able to do uh, this photo shoot uh, at church next Sunday. Hey there, this is James. Thank you. All right, we'll see ya. Goodbye. Okay. So, uh, she said, she said I should be able to go and take pictures of the kids there. Um, yeah, the assignment, the assignment is, uh, a child eagerly opening a gift for the for Lifeline Gifts Ministry. Yeah, all the details are in the description below. But I'm going to go take pictures on Sunday. Now, normally I would, like, have Robert and Kendallin around to be able to take pictures of kids, but they're not in town. So I'm thinking, what kids do I know? Where Who do I know around here that I could take pictures of? And uh, the only people I could think of was at church. And so I just called the Sunday school teacher for the kids, and she she went around um, and contacted all the people that she could think of who would be in the class. And just as a uh, a, a reminder, um, we are taking pictures of kids and people, so we want to make sure to get a release from the guardians, the parents of the children that we photograph. Uh, you can download a generic release from off of the uh, details page. But she said I'm going to be able to go and take pictures. And beyond that, she also said I'm going to be able to go and take video. So I'm really looking forward to going and videotaping the whole thing, photographing this, and just kind of stepping you through what it's like. I'm so scared. I don't know. I'm not. I'm working with people I'm not used to working with. I don't know these kids super well, right? And they're like, you know... I haven't taken their pictures, so I'm not sure how it's going to go. But the next step is, I have no clue what I'm supposed to do next. Um, i got to make some gift boxes, I think. That'll work. That should work. How many of you are procrastinators? It's Saturday night and I'm just now trying to get something for the packages. I did do some brainstorming with Esther there last night and I think I came up with a creative idea and I'm sort of hoping that works. Because if it doesn't, I don't have much time left. This is really awkward taking video in a store. I said there was wrapping paper in here someplace. Um, buying buying toys for the kids isn't absolutely necessary. Um, you could probably, you know, find something around the house or give them a candy bar to the kid that you're taking a picture of. But this is a Sunday school class room of kids. And I felt like I wanted to thank them for being, you know, willing to shoot for me. So or be models for me. So I hope that there's paper in here that is not too Christmassy looking. Hey, look at this. This could work. Let's hope there's enough of it. I should have bought wrapping paper when I was at the store.
package of calendars out here all the time, so I'm set up for packaging stuff out here. And today's gonna be gift wrapping. I've got two sets of three boxes. I'm going to have them open one set at a time. And they're gonna have to open the first box. And as soon as they open it, and I'm taking pictures of them opening it, they realize there's a second box that they have to open as well. So I'll get three chances to be taking pictures before they actually get to the prizes, the gifts themselves. So I'll be able to take pictures three times, twice, two sets of three. This box is a little small. I think that should work. I could always Photoshop it out, but I don't think they would want Amazon packaging material stuck to the top of the box in the pictures. Right? I'm trying to get two boxes, two of the small boxes out from this wrapping paper so they don't all have to be red. It's very Christmassy looking. One side's very Christmassy looking, but the inside isn't too incredibly Christmassy. I mean, it is good Christmas paper, but I hope that should be generic enough. Oh, I don't think that's going to work. I don't think that's going to work. But I'm going to try it anyway. The box doesn't have to be completely wrapped anyway. Box number one. The worst stuff you can give to kids. But it's cheap. What else are you supposed to do? Like give them avocados and asparagus? <sighs> That's better. Package number two. These are the inside packages. Pretty amazing what you find yourself getting into. Doesn't really feel like photography, but it's still fun. Whoo! Gift number five. It takes a long time to wrap six gifts. I just remembered that I forgot to take the price tags off of the gifts. <sighs> oh no. I got a haircut. Where was I? Box number six. That's where I was. Will this close? Oh well, make it fit. I really should have found a bigger box. There's 
gift number six. I have just proven to the world that I can wrap gifts. I don't know how well wrapped they are, but they are wrapped, and that is what matters. Yeah, I don't like it this part. Um, if you have any uh, tips for how to wrap gifts, be sure to let us know in the comments below. I'm really looking forward to tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. <sighs> okay. So, I'm not exactly sure which classroom I think. I think it's over here. This is where the little kiddos meet. So, I think this will be really cute. Um, pictures in this particular room. It's a little bit more, um, it's very rustic. I love, I love how rustic this place looks. And I'm gonna pull up my 16 to 35. I think that's the one I want to use. There we go. Okay. So I should be good to go on that. Just want to make sure I've got battery. Plenty of battery power. Okay, so I'm half a battery, so I need to replace, replace that. There we go. And I've got plenty of pictures. Yeah, raw uh, menu. Where's my quality? Image quality raw. Okay, very important. With the flash, and we're good to go. Actually, I found out that that was not their room. This one over here is. <laughs> so. Sunday school teacher I was working with was not feeling well this morning and was not able to make it. So I think I think I'm just gonna have to wait till next week. It is one incredibly slushy morning and because it's just so bad not really safe I guess to travel they decided to cancel church and because they canceled church it means I'm not gonna be able to shoot this assignment today and that sort of poses a problem because the deadline for launching this assignment is this week. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end the video here. You've seen me shoot a lot of assignments. You should know how to do it yourself. No problem. Uh, just, you know, orchestrate the photo shoot, do what the details say, and um, I don't think you'll have a problem. Challenge yourself, get all the details for the assignment in the link in the description below. If you'd like to watch more videos like this, feel free to subscribe by clicking on my face. And if uh, you have any questions, just 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 ask, and I'll, I'll definitely try to help you out as much as I can on the uh, forums. Just ask on the forums or in the comments below. So, uh, thank you so much for watching. Hope you learned a lot. Keep learning for inspiration, and we'll see you next time.